Hello everyone, my name is Teacher Jonah, and in this video, I'm going to talk a little bit about how to order something at a restaurant in English. So, a lot of times when you walk into the restaurant, the first thing that the host will say is, um, how many people in the group or how many in your party? Um, and party just means group. Um, if you go in alone, sometimes they say just one or just you or uh, just one person today. So another thing that they will say is, do you have a reservation? Of course, if you go somewhere like McDonald's, they're not going to ask if you have a reservation. <laughs> depends on if the restaurant is a normal restaurant or if it's a fancy restaurant. So when you walk in, um, they may say, how many in the party? You say, oh, today it's just me. I'm all alone. I don't have any friends. Nobody wants to eat with me. Or you, you don't have to say that. <laughs> you can say, it's just me. Um, I was going to bring my dog but he wasn't hungry, so it's just me. Okay, that's a bad joke, sorry. Okay, so then they can say, um, they can take a menu and say, follow me, or write this way, or come with me this way, please. Um, sometimes they will ask you where you want to sit, but a lot of times they will not. <laughs> they will just take you to a table, and what I found was that a lot of times they will take you to a table and they will sit you right next to somebody else. Even if the restaurant is very empty, and there's only one table there. They'll sit you right next to that table. And for me, I like to have a little personal space, a little private space. So I will ask um, the, the host, hostess or the server uh, actually can I can I sit a little farther <laughs> and another thing is that personally I like to sit near the window so I can watch people walking by um, that's just me that's what I like so they take you to your table and Sometimes, if it's a host, then that's all they do. They stay at the host stand, they take you to your table, and then they walk back. And they say something like, your server will be with you shortly. Your waiter or waitress is coming soon. But if they do not have a host, um, or maybe if it's uh, kind of slow, means not a lot of customers, then they will say, it'll be the server that takes you to the table. And they might say, would you like to start with anything to drink? A lot of restaurants will take your drink order first. And they'll say, would you like anything to drink? Would you like a beverage? And a beverage just means something to drink. Um, and a lot of restaurants, they have sodas. Some, pe some people in, in the United States, in maybe the South, they call it pop. So they might say, would you like a soda pop? Or they'll just, for short, they'll say, would you like a pop or some pop? It just means soda or cola, you know, like Coca-Cola or, you know, Sprite, Pepsi, something like that. Uh, they have like iced tea a lot of places. Sometimes they have juice. So... After you order your beverage or your drink, um, then they will go away and you look at the menu and then they will come back and say, okay, so what would you like to order? Now, a lot of people, um, they look at the menu and they know what they want to eat. They're let, and you can say, I'll have the chicken, parmigiana, you know, the chicken pasta, something like that. Um, so 
when you order at a lot of restaurants, they have something called an entree. An entree, which means the main dish. Uh, means like the big plate of pasta or fish or chicken. Um, could be vegetarian. Um, and then they also have uh, an appetizer or a starter, which means that usually it's a smaller dish, not always smaller price. Um, and that means they bring that out first, you eat that, then they take it away, and then they bring your main dish. It's kind of like a soup or a salad um, that comes before the entree, um, except that the appetizer um, is not exactly like a super salad. It just it's like a smaller plate, and a lot of people like to order appetizers or starters um, because sometimes they are not offered as an entree. They're not available. They don't have an entree. They only have it as a small dish. And it can be really delicious, really tasty. You know, like some little mushrooms that are stuffed with cheese. Or it can be like a little cheese plate. Or, you know, maybe some asparagus or artichoke, like roasted artichoke. You know, something like that. Um, so they are, to me, on the expensive side, which means a lot of times they have a high price, but they are still very popular. So people will order a few appetizers. You can call them app or apps for short. And what's expected is that when you order an app, it will come first, and then later is when your entree or your main meal will arrive. So sometimes, um, if you only order one app, or if someone else is really hungry, they're starving, they might say, can you bring the apps and the food at the same time? Can you bring everything together at the same time? That's one thing you can ask. Um, so when some people order, they use the word do. They might say, I'll do the pasta. I'll do, you know, the, the fish, the salmon. Um, and so that is one thing you can say, I'll have you know, the pasta, I'll do the pasta, I want the pasta, something like that. Um, and a lot of times people will have sort of special things they want, like, can you make it not very spicy? Can you make it mild, not too spicy? Or, you know, if you order a salad with salad dressing, you might say, can you put the dressing on the side? You know, can you put the the sauce that goes on the salad, like ranch, blue cheese, um, you know, maybe like oil and vinegar, balsamic vinegar, can you put it on the side? Um, and so there's lots of different things you can do with your order. Some people like to add something like, can you add shrimp? Can you add vegetables, you know, something like that. And so then after you make your order, then the server will bring you all the food and you eat it um, during the course of your, your dinner. You might need something like, can I have some extra napkins? Can I have salt? or pepper, or ketchup, um, you know, you might need some olive oil, something like that. Um, a lot of times 
while you're waiting at the restaurant, they'll bring you some bread to eat, uh, maybe bread sticks, um, crackers, some little thing while you're waiting for your food. Uh, and then after you're, you're finished, um, sometimes they will ask you if you would like dessert. Um, and when they come over, if you want dessert, a lot of restaurants have a separate dessert menu, which is usually a small menu. And it has about six or seven items, you know, like tiramisu, ice cream sundae, brownies. You might have like a fresh fruit. Sometimes they even have a cheese plate with fruit for a dessert. And or cheesecake, you can have your dessert. And with dessert, a lot of people will have tea or coffee or cappuccino. Some people even like a dessert wine, you know, like some sherry that's kind of a sweet wine. Or maybe port. I'm not sure. I don't know a lot about wines. And after you eat the dessert, um, then you can ask for the check, for the bill. You can say, uh, can we have our check? Can we have our bill? Or you can say, uh, check please, you know, we're finished. Um, and then of course, when they bring the check, a lot of people will fight for the check. And they'll say, oh, I'll pay. And someone says, no, I'll pay, I got it. You got it last time, let me get this, come on. They fight for the check, um, and uh, and that's basically how to order at a restaurant. So, if you like this video, please like it. Please subscribe. Some comments. If you have any questions you'd like me to answer about English, something in English, please let me know. Thank you very much. Have a nice day.